hello everyone welcome to the ASP.NET MVC tutorial so this is my second tutorial so before proceeding I would like to suggest you to watch my previous videos that is part one of the series so now in this tutorial I will discuss about the controller in MVC and what is the role of routing in MVC so when you start your MVC application so in the URL you will notice that the local host is your server name and home is your controller name and the index is your action method name so let's go to the Visual Studio and open your uh, controller folder and click on home controller so here you will see I have two methods index and get name so now first I would like to start my application let's see what's gonna happen here now here you will notice that I have not passed any controller name or any action method name but still it's loading index page see and now if I pass controller name and index name then again it will load uh, this page so why this is happening so here route concept get into the picture so now if you go to global azax so you will find an application start method so here the register uh, the route will be uh, get registered here so you if you go to the definition then you will see this method get executed at the time of application uh, getting started so uh, here you will see uh, uh, go to the definition here you will see that uh, if you pass your controller name or action name then it will just load your controller or action method but if you don't pass then default controller and its action will be loaded so in my case see index is uh, is getting loaded here so now I am just gonna copy it and just to stop my application and in route.conf uh, route config.cs file I'm just gonna paste it so when the application gets started so uh, this controller and this method will be executed so now run this application now I'm gonna uh, uh, load this method here so see uh, the name equal to a string has been printed so see I have not passed any parameter in this method but still it's loading this and not giving any error so if you go to route config file so if you see notice that the ID parameter is an optional field so either you can pass it or not so if you uh, if I just click on this and I am just loading my uh, get name method here and I'm just passing name equal to Ashish and see name equal to Ashish get printed on the screen so this is how routing works now let's see uh, an, uh, the main understanding now close it and now put a breakpoint here and put a breakpoint here and now start your application so as I said when the application get a start the application start method get fired and it's if you press and uh, continue then route will be uh, getting registered here and so th that is the concept here so when the re user request comes then it it first goes to the application start or uh, 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 it first goes to the application start and uh, route get registered and route just uh, 
uh, search your controller name or action name and it just uh, render to that so this is just all about the routing so in the next tutorial uh, routing and controller so in this next in the next tutorial I will discuss about the view and the model so if you see uh, I'm just gonna add one method more uh, one controller more so just add your controller one controller and I have just added test controller and test controller name now name it testing oh sorry maybe it's running uh, getting error uh, add controller and uh, okay add test controller now here is your test controller and it has or it also has uh, the index method by default now run this application and now in the index uh, place test and oh sorry so now just remove the debugger hmm. and now I'm just gonna load this now it's going to give me an error message so the view index or its master was not found so because uh, I have not added any view uh, for this index and it's returning a view so in the next uh, video session I will just discuss about the view and the models so thank you very much for watching my tutorial if you really like it then give us a thumbs up comment and subscribe okay tada bye bye take care